I found on AliExpress digital torque screwdriver and I thought that it is an interesting item to test it because more famous are torque wrenches but a screwdriver is also an interesting thing because for screwing many things we don't need a wrench screwdriver is enough so we don't want to take a torque wrench but uh, for screwing uh, furniture or plastic things when we want to be sure that we screw them hard enough but we won't break the thing a torque screwdriver sounds like a good thing because we can use it like a normal screwdriver not a wrench but still we can measure the torque that we are outputting and probably it makes sounds when we go to the target value so it may be a useful thing for screwing delicate things that we don't want to be too hard or too soft with screwing them so let's see what is inside here we have a well-protected screwdriver and user manual with a certificate it is well packed we have to use force to put it apart and here we have another layer of protection and when we take it out from here this is the screwdriver quite light and also we receive a few bits for it this is how the bits looks like and on the back we have a plate for batteries there are no batteries in the package so let's take two batteries let's take off the protection foil let's try to turn it on without manual okay it turned on with the middle button without any problem can i try to output some value in hand so it is working let's see the manual so i will know all the features that it has there are four versions of this screwdriver for different torques i've selected the 0.8 to 8 newton meters version and we have accuracy plus minus 2% so good enough for many situations like furniture okay, so now with the manual let's see all the functions the M button is for working mode we have three working modes track for real time pre for preset and peak for the peak value so we have right now track let's press M peak and pre we have those three working modes so real-time just shows in the real-time value in the preset we can select the value so I can by pressing the up button select the value that I want to preset and press M to save the preset value and at 80% it will start to make noises and probably at 100% it will make a different noise but we will see it and the peak is an obvious one that it will show the peak value that we achieved and you can reset and save the peak value we can also select the measurement unit if we long press the M button and we can press the up button let's go to newton meters and by the middle button we save it and we have also data storage and buzzer settings and we can turn off and turn off the buzzer and do factory reset and I think that these are other functions so if I already know how to use it let's test it on some screws I prepared two situations here I have a wooden crate let's try to unscrew and screw those screws this bit fits well and this is bidirectional so we can unscrew and screw screws let's for example go to the peak mode and let's try to unscrew this screw it goes softly i don't need much force and 0.3 newton meters i used to unscrew it let's go to the prepared value let's set it for example to let's set uh, 0.6 newton meters and let's try to screw the screw back and let's see what will the screwdriver do when we will be near this value it is beeping and and it is a constant sound that i achieved the value and let's set it to the bigger value let's go for example to one newton meter 
let's set it to one newton meter and let's go harder with this screw and I can additionally see on the screen what is the current value so I can see that I can hear that I am close to the value and I can see exactly what is the value so it works as expected and other scenario I have a plastic part with screws let's go for example to the track mode and let's try to unscrew the screw let's see if I will be able no this value is too small to measure it but let's go to the peak mode and let's see if I will screw it will I be able to see in this situation any value I can see that I've used 0.3 newton meters to screw this uh, screw into the plastic so for example you can set it to 0.3 or 0.25 to be sure that you won't destroy the plastic by screwing the screw too hard so a uh, useful thing not a wrench just a screwdriver but you want to be sure that you screw the screws well it is good to track and measure the torque and to be sure that we used the correct value. Nice useful device and that's all for today. Like, subscribe and be nice.